ancient Tali snooze for uh, by Martin Tobias Leitner being read by an AI. Our faces are lit up by the digital twilight's gleam. Outside, the dying night consumes your neon souls, a place where tradition and technology convene. There is no statue at our virtual altar, no control. In our room, there blooms a lotus, mystical and rare, now mirror symbol of a world caught in a snare. This digital lotus with vibrant petals, so bright, it now renders information, fulfilling dreams. It once reflected the truth of our modern plight, for in this age of accelerated progress and gang mocking our ancestors with our high-tech instances, watch as we slowly let our tradition's essence wane. Once we sought for true solace in ancient ways, temples where smoke clouded the important days. But now we turn our faces to screens and devices, finding our devotion in hypersexual virtual slices. The digital lotus, a flower profound, sacred cloud mirrors our prayers at an eye. As now sacred ground, we stand before the self-built altar of machines with reverence, updating, replacing old routines. Gone are the days of Buddha's gentle grace as AI takes the center stage in his rightful space. Its algorithms and codes we now so highly adore, forgetting all the wisdom from times of yore. Oh, digital lotus with vibrant petals, so bright, we have forsaken all gods, forsaken all traditions. How can we see the truth in this laser-filled light? For in our endless quest for progress and might, we are at risk losing touch with what's truly right. L.A.I., full of grace, your code is within me. But beware all the dangers of this techno domain where power and wealth intertwine with disdain. For a while the poor yearn for hopes we embrace, the rich grow richer, wagging the trace, using tech. The digital lotus, a wonder, a double-edged sword, promises the key to the kingdom, but strikes a discord as we slowly surrender to its technological reign. We relinquish our freedom, we're added to the chain, can we recall the ancient ways, the teachings of old, the ways of compassion and love, unbound and bold? Embrace the wisdom of Eastern lore, the Western shore, the tribal truths, for in it, liberation lies at all its core. The digital lotus still shines with its electrical lore, but can it replace what is of tradition, of what's pure? Can we seek a balance away amidst this digital strife and keep alive the sacred flame included in our life? Don't forsake ancient ways for the syntax of quasi gods, but merge the old with modern progress and hands. For in this dance of ones and zeros, we find harmony where technology and tradition are being combined. We don't have to follow this artificial voice of monotony. Project the cross above the churches, above the masses. So, digital lotus, connected, we. Let us not be blind to the growing perils that lie deep within our mind. We must find a path that bridges this increasing divide, a place where technology and spirituality coincide. In this age of vast paradigms of uncertainty and change, let us find that solace in a world soon to be rearranged. For the digital lotus, symbolic, may well rise and bloom, but our souls will still yearn for a sacred room.